Hey guys, Peek here again. I'm back with another video. This one is going to be about my warm-up routine or also in practice that I use. And the reason for this is because on my stream, also in, you, in the YouTube comments, I've gotten a lot of questions about what you use to warm up your aim. How do you improve your aim? What should I do to improve my aim? Is aim labs better than Kovacs? And the answer to all of those questions is that I use Kovacs, but also aim labs. And uh, is it one better than the other? Not really. It's um, down, it comes down to personal preference and also if you want to pay for a software or if you want to have a free software. The free one is Aimlabs and the paid one is Kovacs and Kovacs allow, allows a lot more of customizability while Aimlabs looks a bit better but has much more, much less customizability when it comes to uh, making your own modes. Yeah, there's not much more to it. Kovacs looks a, looks a lot less better and um, the list of uh, drills are using Kovacs are floating heads timing 400%, Valorant small flicks, pad target switch, one wall, six targets TE, Valorant one taps, Valorant small horizontal flicks. So what I do is uh, I search them up, add them to a playlist, and then I do that playlist once or twice before playing ranked, and that's pretty much it. Th then I feel warmed up. When it comes to aim labs, I use uh, one called hard Valorant warm up. You can find this one in workshop mode and you just search for it. And um, in the example I'm gonna show you in a few minutes, my practice here will be sped up so that you don't have, have to sit and wait for uh, the missing to be over and then see the final result. And if you wanna see uh, my Kovacs uh, example first, it's coming up right next. And then if you want to see aim labs, it's timestamp time stamped here and you can just skip right ahead to it. So without further ado, let's head right into it.
And that's all guys. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and I hope this helped anyone who was unsure of what they should go for when it comes to uh, in practice. And uh, let me know what goes, how it goes for you in your in practice. And if, it, if you notice that it helps in ranked or unrated, whatever you play. And uh, if you notice anything special, like all oh, my imp improved in these scenarios or in those scenarios, on these agents, on these maps. And uh, yeah, I enjoy, I enjoy seeing progress. And I love hearing from you guys' updates. So let me know. And as always, I'll see you guys next time. Take care.